put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on the floor. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish his opponent. You make one mistake, Night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yeah. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago. But he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business. And that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer. Making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet one is tall, weighing in at 158 pounds. Fighting out of Goldendale, Washington, Magnifico. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the right corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA. Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, Grinton rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Lee gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Throwing that jab now again. The fighter evades. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. <laughs> nice defense there, huge block. Oh, nice jab by him there, and I guess on the other side, hard to get your offense going when your head keeps getting snapped back like a Pez dispenser. Every time he tries to go forward and use his own offense, the jab is stopping him in his tracks. He's doing a great job of fighting behind him. Oh, nice jab. Good punch, Lance. Punch coming, it's blocked. 
And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Flipped with a left hand counter. Just misses there with the left. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Oh, that's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike very effectively. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Ooh, blocks the shot. Midway through round one. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Lands a switch knee. Big punch land. Attempt there is blocked. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Oh, nice combination of kicks once again. Keep your hands up. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Big lands right through the opponent's midsection. He is all about that left kick to the body. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Lee gets caught by the straight punch. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Over and over, he lands big body kicks. Nice, sneaky head kick. Powerful leg kick lands. Look at him drive his shin into his own body with that body kick. Nice punch there by Lee. Straight right hand now, just misses. Jab snaps the head back. That'll get his attention. Oh, he's looking to set up that head kick. No good. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with his leg kick. Shades of Ben Saunders against Brandon Wolf back in the day. A lot of knees, a lot of volume here. I'm not sure how many more he can take. My boy John Annick is a encyclopedia of knowledge and threw it all the way back. But those knees will definitely be the fact that the longer this fight goes. Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how, how good that feels to get kicked like that. It doesn't. It doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. Round two straight ahead. All right, let's check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's going to stand there, and he's not on his toes, and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. All right, second round now underway. I'm no analyst, but a little bit of a feeling out process there in round one. And that's a part of being in the octagon with someone that's so skilled. You cannot just go after them, guns and blazing. Both of these young men are trying to find the right moment to attack. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. If your opponent has you in the clinch, Pull it down on your head, landing punch after punch. You have got to clear that collar tie, reach back inside, and try to find space. Oh, good head movement there. Nice look. Let's 
Lee going with the kick to the body. He's an outstanding kicker, but that attempt missed. Sound defensively blocks the shot. Back and forth we go. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. That's a perfect scramble right there. Beautiful transition. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Big kick lands. behind that leg kick. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Huge block there. Just over three minutes now to go. Oh, beautiful head movement. Slips there. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Oh, big head kick. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Oh, nice counter jab to snap the head back. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. And he landed the right hand there. Lands with the kick there. No pad on that foot. No shit guard. He's taking all of that kick every time he throws it. throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Game of inches right there, oh, boy. Wow. Oh, nice job to defend the takedown and scramble to his feet. There's no give on that leg kick. Effective strike there by Lee. Lands a, lands a right hand upstairs. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Still nice body kick lands. Oh man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. Look at the turn in that kick. What a tricky head kick. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Beautiful one. Stuff the takedown, no problem. Look at those weapons. Look at how he uses his knees to the bottom. Gotta check these low leg kicks. 20 seconds to go round two. Just missed with the left there. Oh, nice hook by him there. How many times can this young man land this particular punch? Ten minutes in the books. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. You're fine. It's just a little blood. We've been here before. You've been cut. No worries. We like the taste of our own blood. 
Now's the chance to go out. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so oh, much right. power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this he round. He doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Ooh, what a head kick. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Well done to block that powerful kick to the body. The guard lands the right hand. Big leg kick lands. Connects with the right. Lift him with the right hand there. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar oh, tie. Defense on the takedown and scrambles to his feet. Nicely done. Oh, buckle him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Beautiful kick. Both guys really throwing with authority. Big head kick land. Big little kick lands under the elbow. Nice strike. Such a fast leg kick. Just over three minutes to go. Lee gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Ball landed another strike to his opponent's liver. He continues to target that area and looks to buckle him once again. Nice punch lands over the top. Surprise, he gets the takedown there. Over and over again, he attacks, he secures, and on we go. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Lee gets up, he is back on the feet here. When you're in a clinch, you can pull down on the head and land these beautiful punches to the head. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good tonight. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. He's just being more aggressive, and because he's being more aggressive and more loose with his strikes, he's landing. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Big body kick. His opponent can survive. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that punch. Oh, big punch lands. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. on bone as the head kick lands flush. He better get those hands up or he's gonna put him to sleep. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs. To throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. You got to whip his hip into that kick. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Effective punch there by Lee. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Way to hide that leg kick. Oh, that is a furious inside leg kick. You ever taken like a five finger to the inside of your leg? That don't feel good. Never mind a kick like that. A full, I mean, slapping your leg hurts. Imagine someone this side. With his shit 
in the inside of your leg. You cannot take many of those kicks. Watch the shot. Oh, landing a punch with the left hand now, so certainly putting it all together on the feet tonight. He's doing a lot of work with his offhand. All right, we now take a look back at some of the highlights from that last round, DC. A lot for the replay guys to choose from. I mean, these guys are going to be very busy trying to find what replay to show you guys. Lands on both sides of the octagon. Both guys fought great. What a phenomenal round. All right, next round is underway, and if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they barely broke in a sweat. Both with good resting heart rate, stamina still very high, and you just have to laud the efforts of these guys in training. Both men certainly noted cardio specialists, but incredible that they would have this much in the tank after 10 plus minutes of fight. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. He has a commitment to kicking tonight in his show. Try to establish that jab. Offensive fight. Nice job to block the shot there. Oh, vicious kick to the outside of that lead leg. You gotta start checking I these, man. You gotta check these kicks, or you're gonna be limping around the octagon very short. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice oh, kick there. Big takedown. Is this the one that's gonna break him? Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Right hand on point. Oh, trying to pass here, but Dikembe Mutombo style, Blocked. he gets denied. Blocked! Great job blocking that pass by the bottom fighter. Both fighters back to their feet now. Just missing on the high kick there. That's a big strike right there. Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Big body kick lands. Wow. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Man, he is so sound defensively. Nice job to raise the guard there. It's the relaxation that allows him to see things coming and block most of the strikes that are coming at him. Nice head kick. Good stick. Nice. He landed it perfectly. Perfect placement. Perfect position. What a huge blow and a big moment in this fight. Big kick lands. Another shot lands upstairs. Oh, oh he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad. Wow. Oh, big knee. Just missed with that right hand. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Keep your hands up for me. Come on now. Liver kick. Stuffs the takedown. No problem. Able to check that kick as well. Nice punch there by Lee. Under a minute to go. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. 
45 seconds remain in the round. Oh! Oh! The head kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it. was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. That was a thudding leg kick. Strong kick to the outside of that lead leg for him there. You do not want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. He does not wind up on that kick, but he somehow is managing to land it with so much force. Nice leg kick land. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. All right, so a big knockdown for him courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's your replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well, but when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal, and if he can land, he does have the ability to damage it. Striking is unbelievable. You're mixing it up perfectly. I love what you're doing with the kicks. Keep those going. He's slowing up. Fifth and final round. Combination lands for him. He is really putting his strikes together tonight. I mean, he's feeling himself tonight, John. He's doing a great job of putting everything together. Lands with the right hand. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Ooh, big shot. This fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when he thought he was going low. And now he's got, he's got to hurt very bad. Very oh, bad. Thunderous. He's limp it a little bit. Tried to stay upright. But man, that changed the complexion of this fight. John, he's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Would you look at the size of that bruise on his torso? Nasty. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Oh, that's a good right hand. Nice job of hiding that head kick. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Right hand punches the clinch. Oh, he landed that kick to the outside of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the tree. You beat your opponent by slowing him down first with those nice outside leg kicks. Oh, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Oh, and he caught the kick. Nice leg kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. Well, he got his head snapped back by that straight hand there, and he's shown a vulnerability tonight by leaning right into that punch as he tries to set up his own offense. He may want to focus on some defense here moving forward. Nice kick there by Lee. Three minutes now to go in the fight. Oh, collar tie. Nice job by him to get the knee to the target there, using his length exceptionally well tonight. Now to go in the fight. And he caught the kick. What a body kick. All right, single collar tie now. Left hand punch. Oh, 
under his leg kick rounds, his opponent tried to stay upright, but man, that changed the complexion of this fight. Johnny's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Oh, stuffs the takedown without it. This is under his leg kick rounds, his opponent tried to stay upright, but man, that changed the complexion of this fight. Johnny's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. As he gets close. He's hurt bad. He doesn't know if he's in the octagon or at his mama's house for Thanksgiving. News hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Knock him out. The fight's done. Big, big leg. News hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Now look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. Right punches there. His opponent squirming like a fish out of water now. The ground and pound is on point. This could very well be the beginning of the end. This could be the beginning of the end. We've seen some really good ground and pound fighters. This young man is as good as any we've ever seen. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. 15 seconds. Oh, lands with the ground and pound strike. Oh, nice job using his strength there to posture up. We'll see what he can do now. He's gonna start looking to land big shots from the top. What a fight! All right, so the fighters go the distance here tonight, but it went a whole lot better for one of them than the other. Talk us through the replays, champ. Some decisions are different than others, and his striking really did separate him from the competition. He fought so well in the stand-up game that he should get a very easy decision. All right, the official decision is in. It resides with the venerable Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest. 48-47. Clearing the winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, nice job by him there as he is your winner via unanimous decision. And sometimes I would think it's easier said than done to just leave the judges out of it. Dominant performance and he gets his hand raised. Yeah, and if you gotta go to the judges, leave no question, right? Be the person that is so 